What's good, homo squad? I wonder if I should start saying it like that. Nah, I might, because then I might copy Darn L. Bradley's thing, so I'm gonna stop doing that. But either way, what's good, homo squad? It's your boy, homo Ziggy. You already know who we back with. We back with Otaku Underworld and my guy Sleepy Ash with Adrenia. Opens. Look, y'all already know when it comes to me and names, certain times it takes me a while to say the name correctly especially if it's a human name so yeah but we're here with Adrenia official audio now it's now y'all already know sometimes with sleepy ash hey he's in his own world and he's in his own realm so you already know anytime when this man drops I'm on it like that so we about to check this out and I, and didn't he drop something else before I don't think he did. The last one I reacted to was the Mongolian Chop Squad. If you haven't, go check that out. But after that, I don't think he reacted to some. I don't think I've reacted to something else that he dropped new aside from this. I would have to go check. But either way, we about to check this out. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get in the video. What you got in store for us now? Yeah. Underworld. Underworld. It's the vampire king. Sleepy motherfucking ass. Sleepy motherfucking ass. <laughs> and I call this one Adriana. Adriana, there we go. See? I was talking to her on a late night Drinking, playing games, being face tired yeah. I had her in the post, she had a great time Now it turned into a weekly date night And now she calling my phone Ooh. I told her never leave me alone I told her I cannot Okay, we got for more of like that slow vibe in search of sleepy ash okay it's still on that rock tone but have you seen but it's basically like this with sleepy ash he'll give you different emotions of how the rock music he does he'll give you like that energetic one but then he'll give you this one but also don't get it twisted y'all gotta remember at the end of the day it don't matter the man the man will give you bars and he'll give you that like rap one where especially with the shake it one where it's giving you like that dance vibe but in a way it still has that like rock element in it so hey either way shout out to sleepy ash and now she calling my phone i told him never leave me alone Damn. Hey. Imagine this. Halloween specials on the screen feeling snug. That is crazy to even. That is such a crazy vibe. That I don't even think that I. You know what? It is what it is. Hey, if that's your type of snugging, go ahead, sleepy ash. And you saying, yeah, we fall in love. We fall in love. And that's a bar right there. We fall in love. But with the autumn leaves falling off the tree, like the fall, like in the autumn leaves and such. See, I be telling you, not only he'll give you like that rock vibes, but I'll also give you like bars and such. Nigga, come on. Come on. Yeah, I sent you on a genuine connection. Yeah, 
affection And I know she meant infinite affection A blessing, I count my blessings First impression was impressive I'm impressed with everything that she do I'm attentive Y'all can tell that with me, whenever it comes to certain rock music, in a way you can say Sleepy Ash has re revitalized my love for like that rock music. Not only him, but Divide and Fable too. But in a way, Sleepy Ash has done it way more for me because it gives me that, that emotion type rock vibe where it doesn't resonate with me on like a video game or anything like that. Which is still cool, right? Don't get me wrong, with Fable and Divide, they'll always give me that, that nostalgia act of wrestling game, like them old SmackDown vs. Raw wrestling games and Sleepy Ash, if you know about that, hey, you and me, that's why me and you connect. But with Sleepy Ash, with his type of rock music, it gives you like that human experience and such, them human emotions. Not to say Divide and Fable don't do it too, but something with Sleepy Ash's type of bars and his type of rock music. Hey, you cannot tell me this don't relate to you in like emotionally and such. Like in a human expressive, in human expressive way. If that's how I would want to name it. Either way, you know what I mean. to sleepy you know what fuck it replay that chorus one more time hold on we can re do that again so that way i can sing along more and such hold on wait for it here we go I was talking to her on a late night Drinking, playing games, being best time Yeah, had her in the pool, she had a great time Now it turned into a weekly date night And now she's calling my phone I told her love and leave me alone And then we came to my home What is he talking about? You know we had to do that again for Sleepy Ash, man. Even though if I wasn't a good singer and such, even though I can't sing for sh- Hey, either way, you know we always gonna show love to Sleepy Ash and all of Otaku on the world, man. And shout out to Sleepy Ash, man, cause like I say, with his rock music, what can you say? I just love it cause, like I said, it gives me that human experience where, nigga, and it gives that like 2000s vibe where I love and such. And that's crazy coming from a guy who's Jamaican. I'm Jamaican. But even though, but then again, music is worldwide. So even a Jamaican can feel like they're in that 2000s rock vibes and such. But either way, y'all let me know what y'all thought about this reaction down in the comments below. And like I said again, shout out to Sleepy Ash. There you go.